My girlfriend said this is the most delicious uh, chicken I'll ever taste in my life. Most Filipinos prefer to eat uh, mang inasal and because according to my girlfriend it's so delicious and the way it's grilled, the way it's cooked is so special. So um, this will be my first uh, experience eating uh, mang inasal. I've tried different Filipino foods. I've tried chop suey, I've tried um, adobo and other uh, Filipino foods. But I've yet to try manginasal. And ironically, this is the best food and I've yet to try it. And here we have the famous chicken in a sal. Most Filipinos eat in a sal with sauce. So, um, according to my girlfriend, it adds a unique combination. Okay, um, inasal usually doesn't come with a tomato a salad, but I, I like to eat tomatoes, so um, that's why we have tomatoes here. And this one here, it's an extra, it's not chicken. This one is fish. Um, it's a fish sisig. And, um, okay, so the fish is cooked in a special uh, Filipino way of cooking. It's a Filipino dish also and I don't know what are the ingredients but I think it's fish then you have the white ones are onions, white onion and then uh, you have tomato and here we have the chicken oil. The chicken oil goes um, with the um, with the rice and the chicken. Okay it adds more flavor to the chicken in a salt. And of course we have juice and then of course the main Filipino staple rice okay so here this is my plate and this is my girlfriend's plate and here we have a plate of extra rice and here we have a uh, special soup what soup is this? I don't know what they call it, it's came from Manisal okay I don't know what soup it is but it's a kind of soup and then they dip a calamansi in it. Does it come like this or? No, 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 I add calamansi. You add calamansi. Yeah. Okay, so my girlfriend added calamansi uh, in the soup. Maybe to give it more flavor. Okay, so let's dig in. And here we have chicken in a saw. Look how juicy this chicken is. I think the brownish color comes from the special oil they use when they grill the chicken. And this is what makes the chicken special. The oil gives it a special flavor and this special look. And here we have the chicken oil. And so you can add the chicken oil to the chicken or maybe to the rice to give it more um, chicken uh, oil flavor, if you will. There is already an added, as you can see here, there is already a chicken oil there. That's why the, the chicken is a little bit brown so you can add a little bit more um, of the uh, chicken oil to give it more flavor. I personally like to add chicken to add chicken oil to the rice. Okay, so let's dig in. Okay, so I'm gonna add a little bit of the oil. I personally like to add it to the rice. The flavor melts in your mouth is so so tasty. Oh my god, and the chicken is so soft. It's a very well known mock uh, chicken in a sal in the Philippines. Oh. It's so delicious. That's why most Filipinos or many Filipinos eat um, chicken in a sal. Yeah. And it's very affordable also. Yeah, and it's affordable too. 
Look, it's so soft. Look at the chicken. And I think it's oily. If you squeeze the chicken, you can see uh, the oil comes out. I forgot about the sauce. So I'm gonna try to uh, dip the chicken in the, so in the sauce and let's see if the um, taste will be different. Mm. It tastes even better with the sauce, with the soy sauce. The, so the combination of soy sauce, and calamansi and uh, chili. So good. I can eat um, three meals just in a saw. Lunch in a saw, breakfast in a saw, and then dinner in a saw. And it's so juicy. I think the juiciness comes from the um, oil. Yeah. The oil they add um, when they when they uh, grill the chicken. And I think they use a special oil, a special sauce for the way they grill oh. the chicken. Oh! Oh my god. I'm gonna add <coughs> tomato because I like tomato. <coughs> yeah, okay. I'm gonna add more oil. I think this is only in the Philippines, not in the South. Yeah, I haven't. <clears throat> yeah, that's true. I haven't seen. I mean, I've tried grilled chicken before, grilled and barbecued chicken. But the way uh, Filipinos grill it is different. And I think the uniqueness of this um, grilled chicken or in the South is um, lies in the chicken oil, I think. Yeah. In the Philippines. A lot of Filipinos try to copy Mang Inasal uh, chicken, but I'm, I'm not sure if someone copied the, the way they cook and the way they use the sauce. Is it a, um, only unique to Filipinos or Filipinos copy from other countries? It's a Filipino. I think the owner of this Mang Inasal is came from Iloilo. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I read. So I think it's a Filipino, Filipino dish. And this is um, fish sisi. I'm not sure if it's grilled or steamed uh, fish. Um, so the fish is cut into small pieces and then they add um, onion and uh, yeah and tomato. So let me try the uh, fish sisi. Mm. They call it bangu sisi. Oh, bangu sisi. Yeah. But it's a fish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. The good thing about the salt is if you dine in, it's a, a what do you call it? A unlimited rice, something like that. Oh, okay, so you can get like as many yeah, as bowls many of rice as you want. Yeah, and you don't have to pay extra. No need. The satisfaction you get after eating chicken in a sal is indescribable. I've never felt satisfied after having a meal before. I was satisfied, but not as satisfied <coughs> after eating uh, chicken in a sal. And now I have a burning sensation um, <coughs> in my mouth because I ate the uh, chili and the uh, sauce. Now I'm going to try um, halo halo. <coughs> This is a Filipino uh, dessert. This is a Filipino dessert. And um, okay, so I'm gonna eat uh, halo halo. 
to cool down the uh, burning sensation in my mouth. And this will be my first uh, time to eat uh, halo halo. <clears throat> It's really, <clears throat> it's really sweet, and I think it's um because when I tasted it, I tasted like ice cream. I tasted ice cream, so I think the um the one of the mixture here, one of the ingredients here is um, ice cream and other ingredients, uh, seeds, coconut, fruits, and um, what else? Okay, so I think the mixture gives it a a unique um, unique taste, a unique flavor to it because of the um, mixture. It's really tasty. At first, you only taste the um, ice cream, ice cream flavor, but but after you mix it. Um, I think give it a good mix <clears throat> then you get to <clears throat> mix all the flavors uh, together now let me see if I will still get the ice cream taste or the taste of the other ingredients as well hmm I think the taste now is a little bit um, slightly different. You can still taste the uh, intensity of the ice cream taste um, has declined a little bit after you mix it, mix the uh, all the ingredients together. Will I recommend in a sal chicken in a sal and uh, halo halo to uh, foreigners and tourists? Definitely. Do not leave the Philippines without trying these because you'll be missing out a lot. And also, if you're Filipino, is if you're Filipino, is there a, a dish or a Filipino cuisine that is similar to a chicken in a song, or is it the only uh, cuisine uh, in the Philippines that is as tasty as in a song? Also, is there a dessert in the Philippines similar to halo halo, or even um, more taste than halo halo? <clears throat> 